it's me Ashley and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. Today guys, I have got for you a Revolution haul unboxing. So yes, today's video, I have done an order from Revolution. It is no secret. Um, if you watch my videos, I'm a big Revolution fan. I usually tend to stock up from Superdrug, but Superdrug have been very hit and miss about getting products recently. And a lot of the things I wanted from Revolution were not in stock on Superdrug but they were on Revolution's own site. So that's what we've got today. So I haven't opened this yet, um, but there's a good few goodies in here to go through. So let's go through it together. Okay, then first things first, I picked up two of my all time favorites and I've talked about them a lot on this channel. I got some more of the Conceal and Define Foundation and the Conceal and Define Super Size Concealer. So I got both of these in a, um, well, F4 and in C4. Um, that's really good, kind of just my standard foundation uh, shade. Um, I tend to go up to maybe an F5 when um, I'm a little bit more tanned. But other than that, this is the colours that I use pretty much all the time. Now these were on an offer on the Revolution site, so an absolute bargain. Um, these were, if you bought the foundation and the super size concealer together, then you got them for £12. Which is incredible savings because this is 9 99 and this is usually seven pounds so 17 pounds you're saving yourself a fiver so i thought that that was an absolute steal really and maybe i should have got more because i always use this stuff okay then the next thing that i got i had seen on instagram and i really really wanted to try so this one is an unnecessary product but i've treated myself um i got the new roxy roxaurus ride or die lip collection um, these are liquid lipsticks and I just thought the colours looked super duper nice and like very me kind of colours. So this was £10 for a set of three. I don't think that's a bad price at all. I might do a little video testing these so I can let you know what they're like. But um, they look promising and they look really nice on like the Instagram pictures and different things. So I'm looking forward to trying those. Next, I got a couple of skincare items. If you watch my recent video about my current morning skincare routine, you'll know that I'd been trying a moisturizer from Avon with SPF in it and I wasn't a fan. So I have bought some from Revolution. They, these are fairly new, um, but they sound really, really nice. So I've got, they do it in a couple of different SPFs. I got the SPF of 30, summer is coming. There's lots of sunshine at the moment. Um, so this one, they tailor to specific skin types. So I got the normal to oily skin. Um, one, my skin's fairly combination. It, can be a little oily at times. So this is really nice and I think it's got in there like niacinamide and things to kind of protect your skin from breakouts as well because SPF is quite um, well known for causing a lot of breakouts. So if this one's got in there like blemish busting properties then that is absolutely fantastic. So I will probably start using this tomorrow. Um, it can be my day-to-day -day moisturizer. So we get in there a good old tub. This costs 10 pounds but it's a big Tub of thing I think this is gonna last a good while so I'm happy to pay £10 for that I think my skin deserves it okay next from Revolution skincare and this is one for a face mask Friday I haven't tried any of these ones these are the uh, Revolution peel off masks the one that I got is the holographic sparkle peel off mask so it's a purpley one and it's supposed to be holographic I love a bit of hollow the packaging is very hollow I don't know how holographic the actual mask is we shall see when we use it i think it looks a bit more just iridescent -y, but it will be fun to try so this one like i say it's the holographic one it's got in there antioxidants of jasmine flower extract and it's got hyaluronic acid in there so that'll be a really nice one to use this cost me six pounds but obviously it's going to have a good few uses in it so i'm looking forward to giving that a try the last bits that I picked up from Revolution then are a couple of nail polishes. I did just add these to the basket as kind of a treat. I'd seen some of the new shades that I really liked and I thought, you know what? Let's treat my nails. Um, I'm trying to grow them and get them to look a bit better at the minute. So it's deserved, I think. Okay, so these, I got two and they were both four pounds each. So I'll start with the first one, which is this beautiful, bright blue color. It's, um, slightly paler than i was expecting i was kind of expecting oh what's the nails ink on called it's really royal blue it's fabulous um anyway i was expecting more of that color but i really like this color i'm thinking of putting this on my toenails i currently have rainbow nails on my toes <laughs> um but this sounds that this looks really nice it's called azure so azure is blue and 
Now I'm looking forward to using that, it's really cute. And the next one then that I got is this kind of orangey reddy colour and this one is called Mango. So I think when you've got like an orangey colour it pretty much goes with anything. So I love kind of doing orangey nails and this was like a reddy kind of orangey tone which I thought would look just really really nice and bright and to be fair these colours go really nice together also. So those are £4 each, I've used quite a few Revolution um, nail polishes now and I've liked every one I've had so I'm definitely happy to try some more. Okay guys, so that was my haul. I didn't pick up a crazy amount. I mostly did it because I wanted some foundation and the moisturizer and then I couldn't say no to those new lipsticks and then while I was there, I might as well shove in something for a face mask Friday and my nails. So I think I've done all right. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you've tried any of these products. Let me know if there's anything you can recommend from Revolution that I haven't tried. Love me some Revolution. So yeah, drop me a comment guys. And if you've enjoyed the video, then please do me a favour and hit that like button and give me a huge thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please make sure that you're subscribed because I'm trying to get videos up quite often recently. I tend to upload on a Tuesday, a Thursday, and I do Christmas Fridays, obviously, on a Friday. So make sure you're subscribed, guys, and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so, so much for watching. See you soon. Bye-bye. Take care.